Welcome Smackers, Kevin Smack here with a new game for you today. We have Conquest of Tiberia. Uh, it's a pretty awesome game. You're going to want to check it out. It is similar to Clash of Clans, um, except you can go ahead and uh, make treaties and alliances, and you can also go through and take over other cities. Like, you literally take it over. Uh, so I already picked my name. Let's go ahead and choose a uh, sign. We'll go with the X. Uh, no, let's go with this. This looks a little cooler. Uh, let's go ahead and choose OK. Uh, here we go. It's going to say, welcome. Uh, this is my J1345. We're going to probably rename that then. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start building a village. First thing we're going to need to do is get wood. Uh, this part reminds me kind of a little bit of Empire Earth. So if you've ever played that, you might like that. Uh, you can go ahead and choose the trees and go ahead and harvest them and you'll be able to start getting some resources with the wood. Um, so now here we go, we got some wood, we can go ahead and create a town hall. Let's go ahead and go to build, buildings, town hall, and we're just going to slam it right there. Let's get this started here. Uh, great game, I really like it. The war system sound, seems really cool um, from what I've looked at so far. Uh, you have two builders. You can build something else. Well, well let's get some more trees because trees are good. <laughs> All right. Well done. Uh, they gave us 200 gems for free, which is awesome. <clears throat> Sorry, which is awesome. And the gems are go a long, long way. I mean, really long. So that's a good thing. Let's go ahead and get some more wood, and we'll look at a building in the meantime. Uh, let's go ahead and start our army up. Um, okay, we'll go with an academy. Uh, we'll just wait for one of them to be free. There we go. That's only going to take a minute. We got another one. Let's go with... What else do we got? We can do another one. Alright, let's do two right away. Um, resources are probably something we're going to want to get, just like um, other similar games like this. Uh, resources will go ahead and help you build your troops. Uh, you need food for your troops and you need um, gold to attack, um, things like that. Um, also to upgrade buildings. So there we go. We're going to go ahead and give that just a moment here. After this, we'll go through and just start gemming stuff. Uh, but since I already have this one started, we'll just give that 20 seconds here. Um, so on the right are your meters, your gold, your food, your wood, and your gems. Uh, on the left is your name and also your um, realm, as you would say. Um, and then you do get a shield for the first 24 hours, so you won't get attacked while you start the game up, which is nice. Now that you have an academy, let's build some troops, shall we? We already got a resource mine going. Um, we'll go with the warriors here. And once the other one's done, we should be able to do... Oh, we need to upgrade, I think. And let's take... Um... Oh, let's build some more resources. We want to get that ready. We'll do a farm this time. We'll just slam these other ones down. They, they're so fast to build. There we go. Oh, yeah, let's just do it. <laughs> we need more wood. We gotta cut some more trees down. Let's do it. There we go. Gold mine's complete. We'll get some more wood from that. Let's look at what else we can do. Let's get a build. Let's get some defense going. No, not yet. We need more gold. Okay. Let's go ahead and see what we can do here. Uh, we need gold storage. Let's go ahead and do that. Do another. Where do I go here? Resource. So, guys, I'm not going to go through um, all the starter area. I'm just going to show you a few more things. And then what I'll do is I'll pause the video, uh, I'll build up my city, and then I'll come back for the rest of the video so you can get a better idea more of the end game. Uh, it starts kicking up when you get like level three, uh, but you gotta get your base down first, you know, get everything going. Um, nope, don't got the gold. Well, we could just gem. See one gem, it's like, it's so cheap. And they give you 200 gems at the very start, so that's good. I think I already have this one building, but. 
Yep, sure. Take my gem. <laughs> what else we got? We're not going to be able to get a builder's hut for a while. Oh, resources. Let's go ahead and put the food storage down. Should have gemmed them. Let's gem the expensive one, or the longer one, I should say. Sure. And we'll go ahead and do another resource. There we go. When your shield runs out, anyone in the realm can attack. So basically you are in a realm and there's different people all around you. Um, let's go ahead and just look at the map real briefly, just to give you an idea of how that works. Yeah, sure. And there's the map. Um, so you have these random people around you. Uh, you don't know what it is until you check them out. Um, you can go ahead and... Uh, oh, I can't visit till level 3. Okay. Um, so we'll, we'll come back to that in the level 3 area. You can see the city is already building up pretty well. Um, and we've only spent a few minutes on it. I always go for that builder's hut because I see the one there and I'm like, yeah, we should do that. Um, defenses, we don't have enough gold yet. Of course we could just gem it. Let's gem it. Uh, we'll go with cannon. One gem, sure. So expensive. <laughs> Joking. Uh, defense, let's go an archer tower. Guard tower. One gem, there we go. Um, so this is kind of how it goes. You do have walls. The walls are in bigger pieces, which are nice. Um, the attacking is pretty awesome. You do have different types of troops. Um, there you go. We have the thief and the warrior right now. I know archers are unlocked next. Um, you can kind of get an idea. There's spearman, there's healer, medic, tech, gunner, warlock. Uh, there's going to be different things. When you hit level 3, you actually have a choice to choose either science or magic. So if you go science, you're getting more technical. Um, if you go magic, you're getting more of the realm of magic. Uh, you know, like warlock and things like that. The cool thing that I like about tech is you can uh, make a mechanical frog, which I saw. I haven't got to make them yet, but I will in the future, so I'm excited for that. <laughs> so that'll be awesome. So guys, this is the beginning of the game. I'm going to go ahead and pause it here. We're going to come back at level 3 so you get a better idea of once we go ahead and move up the chain here. Uh, and we'll build up some of the beginning things here. Uh, but the 200 gems do last you a long time. So I'm just going to pause it here. Okay guys, I'm back at level 3. we got a few things created as you can see. Plus it's expanding. we got our walls set up. Uh, we got some troops building here as well. Um, so here is our city. We have our research center here. Uh, we did go ahead and go with the science side, but it's your choice, science or magic. Um, this, just to give you an idea of a few things here, you can research your troops. Um, kind of similar to uh, Clash of Clans, how you research your levels, you could do that there. Uh, we got our builder huts, we got our training area, we're just finishing up training right now. Um, then we'll go ahead and check out the war area. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the maps. So we can go ahead and choose uh, Roswood and look at it here. So this looks pretty interesting. I think we could take that down. Uh, we'll just wait for our troops to finish. But I definitely think we can go ahead and take that. So that's one that we will try to conquer. Uh, let's go back to the map here. Um, let's check out Kingtown. Yeah, that one looks a little tough. Um, Looks a little tough at this point. I'm wondering if he has like bombs and traps all over too. You never know. Um, so I think we're going to go with Rosewood first. But let's check out a few others here. Uh, this one looks awesome. I like how they set this up. The archer towers, the art in it look really cool. I like how they have like the little flag at the top. He's got the pirate flag out too. That's awesome. Let's check out this one here. All right. This guy is crushing it. Yeah, you guys definitely should go ahead and check it out. Once again, I want to thank, you, thank our sponsors, uh, Conquest of Tiberia. Uh, this game is awesome to play. It's fun to do, especially if you like Clash of Clans and you're looking for a twist. Uh, because it does have that different area where you can go ahead and take over a city. Uh, this is one I don't think I will be able to touch for a long time, um, but it does look pretty awesome. Those cannons are upgraded pretty strong. 
Uh, let's go ahead and check out just a few more here and then we'll do an attack. Wow, look at those cannons. Oh no, that's a, what is that? I guess it's like a, a air defense. Nice. Those walls, that is a really good design. I won't even know where I would start to get into that one. Uh, check out one more. Okay, this one doesn't look too difficult. But I think the other one's easier. I think this one's going to be easier. Because all I see is those two cannons. So we could even just steal all the resources. And then work on the cannons later. But we want to take over that one. Um, let's go back. You can check leaderboards too. Uh, here they are. Uh, the cool thing is you can turn off if people can see your village or not. So if you go to Island Wolf, for example, it's going to come in here. Have a smack. <laughs> uh, and it's not going to show you. Basically, oh, it does. This one does show. Some of them don't. Some of them do. What? Look at this. What? That is insane. You've got dragons and like, what? Earlier I tried to check on him and it wouldn't let me. It said, uh, it said no spying allowed. <laughs> I guess he changed it. I don't even know where to start to get into this one. So looks like he is all the way up there. Crazy. He owns 41 cities, 41 villages he's taken over. That's crazy. Um, so here's the leaderboards. Hopefully you guys will get on those leaderboards soon. That would be awesome. Let's go ahead and go home. It is a new game, um, so you have a great chance of getting up there pretty quickly. Um, troops not quite done. Let's just finish. Uh, we have 81 gems left, so we're not worried. 3,000. We're pretty... Oh, we do have gold. Okay. Actually, let's not do random. Let's do rosewood. So we're going to attack. Uh, we're going to take everyone. Um... Something I've noticed, if you have any survivors, you don't have to recreate them. They stick with you, um, so that's good. So we're going to go for our warriors, I guess, are more of our tank. So we'll do some warriors here, some archers, some spearmen. And then we're going to also put some warriors over here. We're just gonna flood that. And we got some thieves, they'll go ahead and take care of... Thieves are similar to goblins. We'll have them take out those. So we're just crushing this one. Yes, Rosewood going down. Boom. Take it, take it. Congratulations, you won the battle. The village is now yours. You have 24 hours to build up your defenses. Start by summoning a builder here and build an outpost. How awesome is that? So now I get two cities. So I can go ahead and start building here now. That's pretty awesome. So let's go ahead and, uh, that's amazing. I wasn't sure how that was gonna work. That's our my first victory here. Trainer summon, oh, okay. We need a builder first. Uh, can we get to? Yeah, let's do it. All right, now let's build it. Boom. That's pretty cheap. I was expecting it to be more expensive. Nice. So now we can make another city. So I guess you could just keep creating cities and cities and dominating the world. Um, yeah, that's pretty awesome. That is a, a great twist. And now this person loses a city, I guess? I don't know. Poor guy. <laughs> Maybe he can come take it back. I don't know how that part works. <laughs> Let's just not lose our city ever and we'll be good. Uh, so now we get another map to build some more stuff. So guys, this is Conquest of Tiberia. It is available for Android, for Apple, and for Windows phones. It's available on all three. Uh, it's pretty recent. I know, I think it just came out about a month ago. Um, so check it out. I'll have all the links in the description so you can go ahead and just click on that and go there. That's awesome. Now it's like I've taken that over. Oh, and it expanded too. Nice. So now that I've taken one, I can go and take more. What? That's awesome, guys. Check it out. Once again, links are in the description. Um, I am named Kevin Smack in the game, so you should be able to find me there. Uh, looks like they have email 
Um, I don't know if you have to get to a certain level or something, but that'll be there soon. Uh, what does summon do? Oh, just helps make troops. Yeah, I gotta rebuild my troops. Uh, I actually didn't lose too many, I don't think. Unless they stick with the other village. Yeah, I think that's what happens. Cool, guys. So that is the game. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you get any villages, let me know how many you get down below. Uh, I will see you in the game. Uh, thank you for everything, guys. As always, smack out. Yeah. <laughs>